In a small village nestled at the foot of a majestic mountain, lived a young girl named Lily. She was known for her radiant smile, kind heart, and flowing chestnut hair that shimmered like a cascading waterfall. Lily was born into poverty, but her spirit remained resilient, and her dreams soared higher than the highest peak of the mountain. Unbeknownst to Lily, deep within the mountain resided a mysterious creature who had witnessed countless centuries pass by. He was none other than Alexander, a vampire who had lived in a grand castle atop the mountain for thousands of years. Although he possessed riches beyond imagination, his heart ached for the warmth of true love. One fateful evening, while Lily was strolling along a moonlit path, she found herself at the foot of the mountain. Curiosity and an unexplainable pull led her to ascend the winding trail until she stood before the imposing castle gate. The gate creaked open, seemingly inviting her to explore the secrets hidden within. As she ventured deeper into the castle, Lily discovered a room adorned with antique tapestries and dust-covered relics. Her eyes widened with awe as she admired the grandeur of the castle's halls. Just then, a sudden gust of wind blew out the candles, plunging the room into darkness. Fear gripped her heart, but before she could cry out, a voice echoed through the chamber. Do not be afraid, fair maiden, the voice spoke, silky and captivating. I am Alexander, the keeper of this castle. Who dares trespass in my abode? Lily's voice trembled as she replied, I am Lily, a humble girl from the village below. I did not mean to intrude. Please, show yourself. In the dim light, Alexander emerged from the shadows. His pale complexion, raven black hair, and piercing eyes held an aura of both danger and longing. Although centuries had passed since he last felt a human's touch, Lily's presence awakened emotions he had long forgotten. Their eyes met, and time seemed to stand still. Despite their differences in the station and the secrets Alexander harbored, an undeniable connection formed between them. He sensed the genuine kindness in Lily's heart, and she saw beyond the creature of the night, glimpsing the loneliness that consumed him. Days turned into nights, and nights into months as Lily continued to visit the castle. She would bring fresh flowers, and they would share stories under the moonlit sky. Their bond grew stronger with each passing moment, transcending the boundaries of mortal and immortal. One evening, as they stood on the castle balcony, Alexander confessed his true nature to Lily. He revealed the curse that had granted him eternal life and the darkness that dwelled within him. Tears welled in Lily's eyes as she listened, but her unwavering love and acceptance gave Alexander hope that he could overcome his monstrous side. Together, they embarked on a quest to find a way to break the curse. They delved into ancient texts and sought the guidance of wise elders. Through their shared determination and unwavering love, they discovered a ritual that could free Alexander from his immortal chains. On a moonlit night, in the castle's grand hall, Lily and Alexander performed the ritual with the utmost precision. The room filled with a celestial glow as their love mingled with the incantation. A surge of energy coursed through Alexander's veins, and at that moment, the curse shattered, releasing him from his immortal prison. As dawn broke, the first rays of sunlight bathed the castle, signifying the dawn of a new era. Alexander, now a mortal man, stood before Lily, his heart overflowing with gratitude and love. They embraced, basking in the warmth of each other's arms. From that day forward, 
Lily and Alexander chose to live a humble life in the village, where they could share their love with the world. The villagers marveled at their extraordinary tale, but to Lily and Alexander, it was a testament to the power of love and the belief that miracles could happen, even in the darkest of times.